here we have a chassis for a small trailer. It's only about uh, about three feet wide and about four feet long. Question is, is an, um, uh, a sprung trailer with a proper sprung two leaf axle with a cross member? Four uh, waist bearings, flange bearings there. Sides. Um, now the um, the frame um, is a uh, lightweight, and uh, it's just been given a, a coat of under seal. It will be very easy to you're handy with a welder to simply um, cut it off at, at those points um, and to extend it if you want to make it into a longer trailer to um, 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 be used as a boat trailer and of course you could also uh, widen it by um, cutting the bar here and uh, sleeving it to, uh, to make it wider if you wanted a, a wide trailer, perhaps for a boat. Um, well that's the condition of the tyres, they, they're holding air fine, they don't look too perished. Um, I think we probably got another tyre somewhere. Um, so that's the that's the trailer. And the question is, is it possible to build something out of that? I mean, obviously you can simply use it as it is, and well, just put a board on it. Um, well, here's the old board that came with it, but uh, it's uh, it needs replacing. So. But uh, um, a new board on this, and you'd have a flatbed trailer, and you can simply um, have a lighting board tied to the back, although it would need mud guards um, to make it uh, absolutely road legal. Alternatively, because you've only got a, a limited amount of springing here, um, probably kind of a couple of inches, so you're not going to have much of a rise. So you could build up a um, simply by um, extending up here a little bit and coming over. Um, you could uh, widen the trailer without um, widening the wheel distance um, and um, and then ha so your trailer would um, like having a, um, a built up section would become the mud guard if you like it would be it would cover um, uh, and and you'd you'd end up with a, um, a wide trailer or a trailer with a step in it depending how you designed it. And of course you can always uh, change this configuration uh, of the A-frame. Uh, you could simply have a bar coming through um, which could be retractable. You could have a, you could have a, uh, a piece of 2x2 um, um, two two, uh, um, which could um, a box uh, section which could um, go right through or something like that. So depending upon the weight of the 
of the um, what you wanted to carry on it. But the question is, is, is there must be thousands of little trailers like this around the world um, just waiting to be shoehorned into a new use and uh, you could put, put a little shed on it you could have a little uh, um, mobile coffee shop you could have um, um, all sorts of things you could make with something like this um, so use your imagination and look out for little trailers like this and see what you can come up with and give us some feedback and um, um, because it would be really interesting to see what ideas in just a, a little small trailer people can come up with to make money but everyone needs to earn their crust and here's an opportunity an idea but please share the idea with other people so they can benefit from it because only a few people in society will ever do this and so I'm challenging you with a project concept and um, your response to it um, could help someone else uh, it could even save their lives in terms of uh, making them miss some immediate money from a trailer like this. Thank you for watching.